this was such fun to be with other business communicators. What did we talk about? Well, in a crisis, messages just go out of alignment. That is, the things that you're telling your various internal and external audiences with material that you control go away. And suddenly what we call bad words or negative words come into the picture. Incidentally, the number one mistake in communication is repeating and denying a negative word because of how the listener hears it. They're likely to overlook the denial, so they hear the opposite of what the speaker is trying to say. You know, when the nurse says, this won't hurt, you know it's going to hurt. But there are a couple of important learnings out of this to take back to your company. First of all, it is useful to have an organized model of communication. That helps you educate your C-suite folks. Second of all, we pick up and repeat each other's words. And once you're clued into that, you can influence what people pick up from what they hear, what they believe, and what they remember. It's marvelous. It works like a charm. You can keep people from making mistakes.